So how do you as a parent know if your child is prepared for school and ready to start? Well, we've prepared some questionnaires in our book to show you how you might go about doing this. We've covered all the different skill areas that are important and you can fill in whether or not your child already has these skills in place or perhaps only to a certain extent or no, they don't have the skills in place. Maybe you don't know whether or not your child has the skills in place because you haven't had sufficient opportunity to observe your child in the kind of situation. So for example, thinking about your child's skills for making friends, are they able to take turns in play? Well, you would have to have seen your child playing with another child to know this. Well, there are two ways you can go about finding out whether or not your child has these skills. You can observe your child whilst he or she is playing, perhaps with a friend from nearby. Or, if your child is already at a playgroup or nursery class, you could ask the teacher or playgroup reader, who should be able to know themselves, maybe also with a bit of observation too. But that's why the Don't Know column is there for the questionnaire. So go through all the different areas that are important for your child's development and then you can go to the individual chapters where there are a few more questionnaires asking in more detail about your child's capabilities in that area. Sometimes it's, it's an ex the opportunity to have developed the skills is important too. For example, if a child can't feed themselves very well, well, maybe you up to now have been feeding your child because you've been in a hurry and they haven't had the opportunity to develop skills with knives and forks. So those are another area that you might be looking at. So think about your child's skills in all the areas. As I say, do some observation if you need to and then fill out the questionnaires. You should hopefully feel reassured as you go through this list of skills that actually your child is doing pretty well in most of the areas. There may be a few that are not quite so well developed and that is your starting point for taking action. Of course some parents may be a little more worried about their child's capabilities in which case you would need to take things further but the starting point is definitely what you can do yourself at home with your child. Do remember you are the expert with your child and there is so much that you can do to help.